Hey guys, here's another video of a plugin or rather a Chrome extension that completely changes the design game or how we design apps in Bubble. So to give you a short story in the introduction, the other day I was scrolling Twitter and back Nadir Bay shared uh, his plugin or extension Figma to Bubble and I was like, holy cow, I need to give it a try. There is this uh, Twitter page design, you can go check it out. You can give uh, back a follow as well. Obviously, I, I went there, I asked back to give me some uh, access so I could just try the try the app. I just want to show you what I've done so far before I do the tutorial. So once you sign up, there is this page where that lets you to kind of add the Chrome extension. This is how you do it. It's straightforward. It's pretty simple. There is nothing unheard of once you add the chrome extension you go at the figma plugin for this you obviously need to be like a little bit familiar with figma you should probably have the figma account not probably but you, you need to have the uh, a figma account and this is it you just go there you just kind of click on open in figma or whatever i just did in the video and that's it you get the access so you already have it in the plugin and one more thing left to do is to get the access token so in this video we're gonna kind of pause on this one so this is what i've done so far uh, and here is my bubble application and what i'm gonna do is show you how my dashboard looks like this is it so geo blah blah and i've already generated the token i just generated a new one so i'm going to copy this and i'm going to go to a figma this is a figma design system that i love that i try to use all the time uh, which is moon design so i just want to give it a try you go to plugins right and you will see that design is here I just have to paste my token to make sure that this works. So auto layout is green light. So one thing that you need to know about this plugin is that, well, again, I keep calling it plugin, but it's Chrome extension. And one thing you need to know is if you design stuff in the Figma and, and elements are not auto layout, it means it's not responsive it's fixed so the elements will be copied around into the bubble editor as fixed and everything will be like you're going to have to do most of the job if it's auto layout it means it's already responsive and it will be responsive in, in, in bubble editor as well but to be very very honest i really do not care about that feature as long as i get this design inside the bubble editor i'm pretty calm like pretty, pretty satisfied with it I can just uh, make it responsive myself in, uh, in in bubble also you see this is the list right probably i have to switch it not probably but for sure if i need to use this i will need to switch this back in, in put this back inside the repeating group so you're gonna still have to do a lot of work but obviously this uh, if this works it's fine so i'm i'm gonna stand on the model dialog Convert to bubble. I think that's it. I go to bubble now. Copy. Paste. Boom. I've got buttons also. I've got these HTML icons which is always pain in the back to copy over. So let's preview how this looks. This is pretty damn nice, man. Like this is already great, you know? I can just, uh, well, this one doesn't work. Uh, but obviously this is like uh, a group. So this is not the slider input. So yeah you have to make some changes but overall the 
functionality is there and that's pretty cool also what i'm glad about is that you don't have to kind of necessarily copy over the whole pages you can just grab item by item and just go about it also this is fixed yeah so you have to do like some of the responsive stuff you have to do you have to put this inside the repeating group as i already mentioned but uh this changes completely changes the name of the game man so if you go to design systems for figma.com i've got like very bad uh, internet connection right now but if you go to this website design systems for figma.com you will see a bunch of different free design systems so if you are an engineer who designs applications like it's 1996 you can go to this website use bex chrome extension and figma plugin and you're all set to create nice designs so anyhow this is it for today i hope you enjoyed it design.io and please do not forget to subscribe to my channel take care mm -hmm.